just out from state troopers this morning. They say that Colorado has set a record this year in seat belt use, which now they're saying more than 88% of drivers and passengers are buckling up. That's good news. But there's also a flip side to this news. Yeah, Colorado Springs and Pueblo are not doing so well. In fact, they have the lowest seatbelt percentages in the entire state. KRD on News Channel 13, Scott Harrison is live along 8th Street on the west side here of Colorado Springs with a closer look at the numbers and what it all means. Yeah, guys, the State Patrol does this seatbelt study every year. And as Josh was just saying, the latest numbers that came out today is that the percentage of seatbelt use among Colorado drivers and passengers is now at 88.6%. That's 1.6% higher than last year. But those numbers would be even higher if not for El Paso County and Pueblo County bringing up the rear. And we got some video of a graphic to show you exactly what we mean. According to the new study, El Paso County is at 79% and Pueblo County is at 74%. Those are the second and third worst percentages in Colorado. This year, though, Pueblo County improved 7%, but El Paso County dropped 7%. It's a little off-putting, mainly because, as stated, you know, you want everybody to make it home. Um, as far as surprising goes, I can't say, again, for the click it or ticket, we'll work with more campaigning just to get more word out to say, hey, you guys need to be wearing your seatbelts. It's is a law through Colorado. Now the state patrol says that the click it or ticket enforcement in coordination with local law enforcement agencies seems to be the best motivator for seatbelt use. The study also found that people use seatbelts less as passengers and less on secondary roads. Even with Colorado setting a statewide record for seatbelt use, however, the state is still below the national average of 92%. So we've seen progress, it can still get better. We're live along 8th Street in Colorado Springs. Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.